Hello everybody, RK Stud back with you again. This one, um, I'm going to start showing you some of my trades first, I believe. Um, right here we have the Action Bible. Yeah, love it. Next we have Amazing, Fantastic, Incredible, Stan Lee's graphic novel. Marvel Masterworks, Amazing Spider-Man, Volume 1, Amazing Fantasy number 15 and issues 1 through 10. Marvel Masterworks, The Amazing Spider-Man, 1964. Saw the issues right there. Volume 2, collecting issues number 8 through 19, annual number 1. Wow. That broke. Amazing Spider-Man Volume 3 Marvel Masterworks. Numbers 20 through 30. Annual number 2. Amazing Spider-Man Marvel Masterworks Volume 7. Issues, let's see here. Oh, come on, I can't read it. Oh, right there it is. 62 through 67. Annual 5, Spectacular Spider-Man Magazines 1 through 2, Marvel Masterworks Amazing Spider-Man Volume 8, 68 through 77, and Marvel Super Heroes number 14. Spider-Man vs. the Black Cat, various issues of the Black Cat, including our first appearance. Uh, the Death of Gene DeWolf, Spider-Man, featuring, featuring the first appearance of the Sin Eater, who's just returned back. It's a very good story. Uh, Craven's Last Hunt Trade. Hard... Highly recommended. Okay, we have some pops here. Chewbacca, there's Luke Skywalker, the child. We have some Ohio State bobbleheads. Jim Trussell, Urban Meyer, who I believe got thrown under the bus by his racist black coaches, bosses. Archie's Americana, 1 through 4 hardcover, 40s, 50s, 60s, and 70s. Hamilton Books had this for 25 bucks. It's no longer on the site. The Archie Wedding Special. Where he goes down a path, and one path, he sees his life with Veronica... The other one is Life with Betty, which leads to the Life with Archie series, which I gotta get them yet. That's a good series. The other one I got is the last issue, which features an Alex Ross cover. If that tells you anything. Avengers Marvel Masterworks, Volume 1, 1 through 10. Avengers Marvel Masterworks, Volume 5. Issues 41 through 50 and annual number 1. Yep. They were kind of late with that. Marvel Masterworks Volume 6. 
51 through 58. Daniel 2 and the X-Men number 45. This is an Ollie's buy. The Legacy of Thanos. Avengers 255 to 261. Annual 14. Fantastic Four Annual number 19. And. Ugh. Gotta put her back up, sweet lady. Miss you, Grams. Okay, we have some WWE cards. Some baseball cards right here. King Tut Pop. King Tut Figure. If that tells you anything about who my favorite character was in the Batman TV show. The Miz, my brother picked him up for me. That was a surprise. From UFC Chrome. Just my phone box. Some more WWE cards. Ugh. Badly damaged. Complete Frank Miller Batman. Which includes The Dark Knight Returns in year one. Batman Death in the Family. Second or third printing? Second printing. And signed by Jim Starlin. Batman, Lonely Place of Dying. First appearance of Tim Drake. Batman Hush, Volume 1. And Hush, Volume 2. Joker, Death in the Family. Death of the Family. Signed by Edward Barato. Hardcover, The Killing Joke. Batman 66, Volume 1. Batman 66, Volume 2. There's a picture of King Tut. Batman 66, Volume 4. Battle of the Planets, Volume 1. Battle of the Planets, Volume 1, from Top Cow. Battle of the Planets, Volume 3, from Top Cow. Best American Comics 2006. This is all independent stuff. And 2007. Some pretty good stories, actually, from independent creators. Uh, crash. Okay, Bone. The complete volume. And... For Robin, little Ted the Bug there, there's Bone Bone, and it is indeed signed by Jeff Smith. Hey, one of the very first early trades, bring on the bad guys. Camelot 3000, it's not too bad of a series. Captain America Marvel Masterworks Volume 2 Tales of Suspense 82 through 99 and Captain America number 1 Captain America and the Falcons Secret Empire 
issues 169 through 176. Captain America Epic Collection, Dawn's Early Light. Issues 247 through 266 and annual number 5. Captain America Winter Soldier, issues 1 through 7. Uh, before Excalibur, Captain Brendan. Which is his British adventures. Alright, that is all for now.